So what complications you have seen uh, in these patients with various type of lipodystrophies? So from a health standpoint, probably one of the most severe complications even across all the ages is going to be the hepatic steatosis which, le which can lead to fibrosis in the liver and then that can lead to end stage liver disease. That we were surprised to see that that fibrosis can actually happen at a very young age. And we've been able to do liver biopsies in children as young as 18 months. And we were really struck to see that even at that age, when they aren't really having a lot of the other metabolic complications of the lipodystrophy, they're already experiencing fat in the liver and damage to their liver tissue. So of all the complications, that one's probably the most significant for their long-term health. Obviously, we see insulin resistance, hypertriglyceridemia, the loss of adipose tissue, though often that comes about as maybe more of a social and physio physic psychological symptom that the patients will have. And the girls will say that they're teased that they look like boys or that they, they changed from a girl to a man. And that, though that actual physical symptom of loss of fat leads to the other complications yes. we're talking about, yes. the loss of fat can really cause the patients a lot of psychological damage in their everyday life. So we, we, we've also seen, uh, certainly, you know, they have severe diabetes, which is very difficult to control. Some of them will develop retinopathy and blindness due to that. Some of them have required uh, renal transplantation because they develop end-stage renal disease related to diabetic nephropathy. Mm -hmm. So <clears throat> we haven't seen, although we see lipid problems, these patients have diabetes. Uh, in partial lipodystrophies, we definitely see coronary heart disease and mm -hmm. atherosclerosis, but in younger people, so far, we haven't seen too many patients who have developed atherosclerotic vascular complications, but the other complications really take a toll on them. That's true. And then there seems to be certain kidney diseases in association with the lipodystrophy that aren't related to the diabetes. And then we've had patients that went on to develop need for kidney transplant, which it seems to be another condition related to their diabetes. And that's picked up by pro high protein levels in their urine.